What's up, YouTube? It's Saturn Kill from the Delray Customs YouTube channel. I got the iPhone 5 here. We are currently doing iPhone Watch 2012. As you notice, we have our 8 pin USB connector into our factory Porsche audio system. So we plug the phone in, comes right up. We go to, it says iPod ready, so the car obviously reads and sees it. We go to our media, touchscreen works, all our searchable artists, everything. At least on the Porsche 2013's 991 chassis code, 911 Carrera convertible on this car. Works absolutely fine. So working good. So, since we figured the iPhone 5 works so good in this car, obviously we had to put a bang and sound system in it because that's just what we do here at Allen and Auto Sound Marine Del Rey. Needed a little bit of bass. And how we were able to achieve this in this car since it had the factory bow system, first thing we did was we took a Rockford 360 controller and we molded it here into the center console. So now I got my bass control, as you hear the bass boom up a little bit here on the video. And then we also have our punch EQ control. We did four factory presets for different types of music on this car. Hides away, we remodified the ashtray. And you ask yourself, how do you get two tins in this car? Well, we eliminate the rear seat and we build this nice custom piece. So we have two 10 inch W3 JL subs under there. We put a cup holder for your Starbucks cup to go right in the back. Molded it in, made it look as factory as possible. This is great, so if you have dogs, animals, you don't want to have to give people rides in your new car. This is the rear seat eliminator now for the 991 chassis code on the Porsches. Nice and beautiful, 2013 Porsche. We added a backup camera on this car. This one didn't come with a backup camera, so we were able to add a backup camera on the car. So, the switchable camera so you have on your driving. Go to your media right here on the screen. Source, TV. Put it on mix. See, there's your backup camera right there. Also, put your classic iPod 4S since it is now a classic. We have the audio video integration cable so you can actually play iPod video directly on. Non iPhone 5 compatible but that will be coming soon on the next mission. And if you want to follow me under the hood or the bonnet for you true Porsche connoisseurs, what we were able to do we went ahead and here's your two JL audio amps, here's the Rockford 360, here's the processor. The cover is physically being walked over. Right now I'm going to slap the cover on so you can see the finished product. Joe's going to tell you a little bit about the product we put in the car. We used uh, JL Audio's HD series amplifiers. So for the bass we used an HD 750 slash 1 to power up two 10W3 V3 2 woofers. As far as a 4 channel, we use their HD 604, so it's 150 watts per channel, more than enough to get a set of three ways or components playing. To tie in the two amplifiers, we got the new Fosgate 360.3, and then best of all are your front Focal speakers, which are the Polyglass 165 VR3s, and then in the rears, the 100 VRS slim shallow components which are a four inch and tweet as well as crossover for the rears it's only a rear fill but still gives you more than enough volume gonna picture the front boot again so we pretty much created a false floor and wrapped it in the same color black carpet so it's completely hidden and he could still throw all his personal gear on here once again, this was Joe and Saturn from Allen Ed's Auto Sound in Marina Del Rey. Feel free to give us a call here at the shop, 310-827-8121. Take a look at this car just one more time. Hold on, one more snippet. What we got? A little, little Wayne for you to leave you with on the video input. Just listen to that audio. Your hell proof. I, I walk up in the world and cut the lights off. And confidence is a stain they can't wipe off. Huh. My word is my pride. My wisdom is bleak. I had or I pod playing on the stock screen. And bribe. And when it got too heavy, I put my bird. Thanks, YouTube.
转。